All right, so you have a bunch of transformer from the microwave. All right, so I don't want to throw it away and cause a, a pollution to the environment. All right, so you have so much a uh, transformer microwave and um, it have the metal, right? The metal around it, metal casing. Then you have the cup and aluminum. All right, so you want to save the environment. You want to recycle all these things right plus make some extra money on the side and uh, they could probably use the money to buy more tools or something right so this is copper and aluminum right so this came out from a transformer right you can see the thick winding and the small winding right sometimes the thick one is big copper Right, sometimes you take one be copper, sometimes the tin one does be um copper or aluminum. Right, so this is a full bucket and this weigh probably about about 40 pounds of copper and aluminum. Uh nah, not 40 pounds, I believe it's about 60 pounds of copper and aluminum. Right, so today I'll be showing you how to recycle all these transformers. And by the way, this is probably about about 30 transformers are scrapped. Alright, this is about 30, probably 30 transformers scrap and I'm too sure it could be less than 30 a scrap and I get all these aluminum and copper. Plus I have the metal casing one side. And the metal casing weigh plenty. Probably about close to about 200 pounds it weigh because this is very heavy. Right, so today I'll be showing you how to get the copper aluminum, how to dismantle this. And the tools you need is a, is a flat head screwdriver, right, a gloves, a chip and hammer, and a hammer. Alright, so let me show you what you have to do first. First thing, as you can see, it well. Right, it have been a well right, right here on the edge, both sides. So, now whenever you're doing this, you don't want any kind of current to open this. You don't use a, a angle grinder or no power tools to open this because the more power tools you use, it come like here you will be bust the more power tools you use you wouldn't make any money because you're using power tools and the power tools is current and current comes a bill right current comes a bill so you don't you don't use no power tools for this you use the manual tools right so you take a chip and hammer all right so you take a chip and hammer and you, you knock on your welding spot like this and just like that the plate come out the bottom plate they put that side all this is pure metal all is for steel and all is for to recycle right so you take your flathead screwdriver now and you put it below here and erase Right, so this is as you can see this one burn out very bad right so this have a little weight so this is copper yeah some it's very light is aluminum it has no difference by the weight but to make sure to make sure you must you have to scratch it to see the color all right so you see that color there that brown color there that's copper Normally, when it, when it scratch it and it white is silver, is aluminum. So this is copper. All right. So a slack net. So here's this piece here. Piece of metal.
Alright, so this one gives me a little trouble. Normally, it'll be out easy, but this one gives me a little trouble. So, I'm gonna do piece by piece. Alright, so come out. Next step is this wire. Uh, now is to take out this part. Now to get this out, you gotta pong this. Right, so you're taking a hammer and you pong it like this. Alright, so this part come out. Now you need our gloves to do this because these are very sharp. Alright, so you can see I didn't these gloves on this hand because this doing most of the work, most of the pulling out. And this is this hand just holding stuff. There you have it. Right, so this heavy, so this look like copper. And if you watch carefully, you see the color. It's not white, it's not silver. It's copper color. So this is copper. So I will add this to the bucket. Alright, so, so we have copper and we have metal. So copper aluminum, copper aluminum, metal. Alright, so I have one more again out. We'll take out this in a while. So now we can take all this metal, all the copper and aluminum, recycle it, save the environment. Plus, all right. So after scrapping all the transformer from the microwave oven, this is the winding from the transformers. Right, is 24 transformers, and this. This one across there is um, is copper, right? So like copper, that is twelve winding of copper, and this is the aluminum. The aluminum winding is thirty six winding, right? Thirty six winding, and this is some of the, the aluminum from the winding too. So we have any copper, the twelve winding any copper is. 11 pounds and a half and the aluminum winding um, 36 winding is 15 pounds and a half of aluminum all right so this is all from the transformer for microwave As always, thanks for watching all my videos. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, leave a comment below. Until next time, Mr. Fixit360 saying good luck 
with all your cyclins.